this video we are going to discuss few more questions on auto transformer. Let us see this question. A single phase 10 kVA 2000 by 200 volts 50 s transformer is connected to form an auto transformer. Actually it is 2000 by 200 but now this is connected as a auto transformer as shown in figure below. What is the voltages of this V1 and I2? What are the values of V1 and I2? First of all, is this is connected in addition or subtraction? See, this is leaving from the coil, this is entering into the coil. So, ultimately subtraction, so V1 is equals to 2000 minus 200, which is equals to 1800 volts. Voltage is 1800 volts. Only one option is there. What about current? The transformer is a constant power device. So, voltage into current. Voltage into current should be constant. This voltage into current is equals to this voltage into current. So, three zeros, three zeros, two ones are, two nines are. So, the current I2 is equals to 45 amperes. 45 amperes is your answer, simple question. Next one. A 50 kVA 3300 by 230 volt single phase transformer is connected to, connected as an auto transformer shown in figure below, the normal rating of this transformer. Initially, this is 3300 by 230 volts, but now this is connected as 3300 by, 3300 by 3530 volts, 3530 volts, yes. So, what they are asking, the, the normal rating of the transformer will be. So, can you tell me, initially for 3300 by 230, its value 50 kVA. Now, the value will be, just by comparison, you will get the answer simply. These two are same. So, for 230, 50, for 3530, how much? Into 50 by 230, 0, 0 cancelled. So, 23 once, 23 once, 23, 23 nothing but again 12, so 123 will be there, 123 nothing but almost 4 za, 5 za, 5 za, 25 za, 100 and 15, 115, 15, so the 8, 8 and 0 is there, so almost 23, 3 za almost 23 is a, so 69, 69, so the 11 point will be there, we need to take point here, 11 nothing but again 110, almost 23, 4 is a. it will be 4 is or 5 is around, so which is, which is a relevant answer, 500, 250, 153 times of 5, 500, 250, 15. So, 765 change, 765 change. So, the answer is 767.4. 767.4 is your answer. This is way of calculation. Just by comparison, initially 3300 by 230 volts, 50 kVA. But now 3300 by addition of those two, when both are added, this is the value. So, for that voltage, how much is the power? Simple by comparison. Next question. In a auto transformer, the voltage ratio V1 by V2, where V1 is greater than V2, where V1 is greater than V2, then the transformation ratio, can you tell me? LV by HV, LV nothing but low voltage side, V2 by V1. So, the conducted power in terms of total power, the power transfer due to conduction, the power transfer due to conduction is equals to 1 minus k into total power. That is 1 minus k into total power. 1 minus k, V1 minus V2 by V1 into P. This is the power transfer due to conduction. If they asked you, if they asked you, sorry, this is the power transfer due to induction, Amma, sorry. This is the power transfer due to induction, right? They asked you that the power transfer due to conduction. Yes, power transfer due to conduction, how much? K into P. 
power transfer due to conduction how much k into p what is k here v2 by v1 into p just remember this actually they asked you the power transfer due to conduction conducted power if if they asked you induction power you can calculate power transfer due to induction and power transfer due to conduction very unique formulas actually these are very important for a diploma level exam next question next question a 400 by 100 volts 10 kva two winding transformer reconnected as a auto transformer across a suitable voltage the maximum rating of the transformer see this is very important Initially, the transformer rating is, this is the transformer rating, its rating is, uh, its KVA rating is 10. This we can connect it as a auto transformer of 400 by 500, auto transformer of 400 by 300, auto transformer of 100 by 500, auto transformer of 100 by 300. Like that we can convert into auto transformer in four ways. But here, what they are asking, the maximum rating of the transformer they are asking. To get the maximum rating, to get the maximum rating, the, the transformer should be HV by addition. The auto transformer should be in between these two, which is HV, 400 is the HV and addition of these two, 500. This will give you the maximum rating. Once calculate, both are same 400, 400. So, for 100, 10 kVA, then for 500, for 100, 10 kVA, for 500, it should be 50 kVA. So, the maximum rating of the transformer is 50 kVA. The maximum rating of the transformer is 50 kVA. Sir, can you calculate for this, how much you will get? Yes, calculate. So, 400, 400, same. So, for 100, 10 kVA, then for 300, for 300, for 330 kVA, for 330 kVA, that is not a maximum value. Next, sir, for example, for this, can you calculate? Yes, I can calculate for this also. Once you see here, once you see here, 100, 100, same. So, for 410 kVA, for 410 kVA, then for 500, how much? Then for 500, how much? 1.25, sorry. 12.5 kVA, 12.5 kVA is there, 12.5 kVA also answer but not our correct answer, we need maximum rating, this is actually two winding transformer, if this is reconnected as auto transformers which is the maximum rating. Now let us see here, calculate for this, 100, 100 same, so for 410, for 410, then for 300 how much? Then for 300, how much? Ultimately, ultimately 2.5 rest, right? So, 7.5 kVA, 7.5 kVA. Of course, these are the four options, but which is a correct answer here? Maximum rating is a 50 kVA. Sir, have you got 7.5? 300 into 10 divided by 400, sir. 3 by 4 times of 10. 3 by 4 times of 10, 3 by 4, 0.75, 7.5, like that you can calculate easily, Thomas. Let us see, a single phase 50 kVA, 1000 by 100 volts, two winding transformer. This is 1000 volts by 100 volts, two winding transformer, is connected as an auto transformer as shown in figure below. It is rating, they are asking the rating. Very simple, see here, this is a, already they given connected in addition, simply they are connected in addition. So, what is the, what is the way we are, we are using to calculate the rating? Initially, the two winding transformer, its rating is 50 kVA. But now, we have a auto transformer, this is my auto transformer, which is 1000 by 1100, its rating will be, this 1000, 1000, just keep aside. Just compare remaining two voltages, compare this, for 100 volts, 50 kVA, for 1100 volts, what will be the answer? What will be the answer? Cross multiplication, 1100 times of 50 by 100, 0, 0, 0, 0, so 110 phi is a 550 kVA, so the answer is 550 kVA is your answer. 
otherwise see here the voltage multiplied by 11 times when the voltage multiplied by 11 times the kva rating also should be multiplied by 11 times that is your answer a simple way of question next and last one in our auto transformers a 400 by 100 volts two winding transformer is reconnected in an auto transformer suitable voltage source the maximum rating of such an arrangement Initially, they given 400 by 100 volts transformer. Its KVA rating is 10. This is reconnected as auto transformer to get a maximum rating. To get the maximum rating, the auto transformer should be high voltage by addition, which is high voltage is 400. Addition of these two is a 500. So, what will be the rating? What will be the rating? Tell me 400, 400 common, keep aside. So compare these two for 100 volts, 10 kVA. For 500 volts, the answer will be 50 kVA. The answer will be 50 kVA. These are few questions on auto transformers. Is it okay, guys? Right.